There's some really interesting new polling that's out today that suggests that the public are really unhappy with all these stories in the news about donations. New polling from YouGov, published on the 7th of October, says that 76% of the public are against MPs receiving gifts such as clothes. The polling also has other questions, and it says 69% of the public are against MPs having second jobs as political consultants, and 66% are against MPs receiving free tickets to um, sporting and other kind of events. If you want to find out if your local MP has accepted these kinds of gifts, we make that really easy on our website, They Work For You. If you put in your postcode on the homepage, it'll take you to your MP's profile, and you can find out about their voting record and what they've spoken about as well, but there's a tab that's called Registered Interests, and that makes it really easy to see. If you're interested in gifts, tickets and hospitality, that's Category 3, whereas Second Jobs and Other Earnings for MP is Category 1. There's actually 10 categories in total, so there's other things like shareholding, if they own any land, whether they take any income via rent, and if they've been on any free trips abroad. It's all available there for you to see on theyworkforyou.com. At My Society, we want to do more than just publish the information that's already available, we want to improve the information that's out there. So that's why we've got a brand new project, Who Funds Them, where 50 volunteers are helping us mark every single MP's register of interests. We're answering 32 questions for 650 MPs, so that's over 20,000 questions in total. Make sure you're following us here so you get all of the updates from the project. And if you're able, please do consider donating, because that would help us do more of this work. So if you wanted to have more information about the Who Funds Them project, there's a website especially for that, whofundsthem.com, but theyworkforyou.com is the website where you can put in your postcode and find out about your MPs register. Let us know what you find out.